is not horrible. This is not what people think it is. It's just a little different. That's all. Um, sometimes I want to shout it from the rooftops. It's the best thing ever. <laughs> if you only knew. Um, but, you know, you don't think that when you're pregnant with your child with Down syndrome. You know, you think, why me? And I was depressed. I was definitely depressed. These angels that walked amongst us that people looked away from, that people spoke with sympathy or pity, even the most liberal of people, still upon hearing someone had a child with Down syndrome, they ask, are you okay? Instead of, that's fantastic, you're about to embark on an incredible journey. It's funny, I was driving down here and I was thinking, I know some of my girlfriends are trying to get pregnant and I thought, oh, it'd be so great if they could have a kid with Down syndrome. I know they don't think that way, because I certainly didn't. When I got the diagnosis, like everybody, I was devastated. But it's the best. May the long time sun shine upon you. Oh, love. Fourteen years ago, I was a very lost soul. Um, I was really deep into drugs and. Um, really didn't have any direction in my life. Um, I had a business. My business was failing at the time because of that. My personal life was failing because of that. Um, and then uh, my girlfriend became pregnant and we had a, a little girl and she just really made me see that um, this little girl needs me. And I really truly believe that she was put into my life for a reason. And that reason was to save me from myself, um, <clears throat> uh, to save my life. And I, and I really believe that she did do that. And so in return, I, I believe I was uh, put into her life to nurture her, to love her, to encourage her to, to be whoever she can be and be what she can be. and and. Um, just be full of love and, and that's what she is and that's what we are um, so I, I needed something in my life and I wasn't sure what it was what that change I, I know I knew what the change needed to be but I didn't know to, how to go about doing it until uh, my beautiful little girl was born It may not be the easiest journey. It may not be the journey that someone would consciously, given all the cards in their hand before they have the experience of this community, would choose. But no one ever says, congratulations, that's fantastic. You're about to embark on a journey of gratitude and love. That's extraordinary. That's blessed that you just, that few people will have a chance to do. To, that to. this relationship with a kid with Down syndrome, a friend with Down syndrome, a sibling or a grandchild forces you because of the purity and beauty of this community forces you to have that experience of gratitude. Most other experiences in our life, we have to try to find that gratitude. And this one makes you. There's, There's one. one.